guys in this video <clears throat> let us look at child height calculation uh, you can also call it as length okay so basically this is ideal just look at this at birth it will be around 50 centimeters okay at 3 months 60 70 so 50 60 at 9 months 70 at 1 year 75 so this much you try to remember at 1 year it will be 75 centimeter this is an infantometer which is used to measure the length right in this horizontal scale they are calling it as length so what is the weight of uh, sorry the length of the baby at birth full term baby 50 centimeter very good what is it at uh, uh, one year 75 centimeter very good then um, so what is this one year 75 this much we remember right at four years it will be one meter remember this much four year one meter okay <clears throat> after that five year six year seven eight nine ten see till ten years what will happen <clears throat> 4 to 10, you can just add 5 centimeter every year. Okay, so let us say if it is 100 here, what will it be here? 105, 110, 115, 120, 125 and 130 centimeter. This is what we are getting, right? We are getting around 1.3 meter at 10 years of age. Let us look at the calculation. There is a formula here that is from 2 to 12 years. From 2 to 12 years, the formula is age in years into 6 plus 77. So, let us look at this. Let us uh, t choose which, which age you want to choose. Let us look at 5 years. Okay, 5 years, some kind of a standard. Okay, 105 we should get. Let us see. So, let us take this as 5, 6, uh, 5, 6 are 30, right? 5 years into 6, 30 plus 77. So, what should we get? 30 plus 77 is 107 centimeter. We are getting for 5 years. 107 centimeter for 5 years. Here, what did we get? 105. Okay. What is your age? 6 years. Six years. Yeah. So, what should your height be? One one zero. One one zero. Centimeter. Centimeter. Yeah. So, let us look at some other uh, value here. At ten years, one thirty. So, what and all you want to remember? At one year, seventy five. At four years, one meter. This much you can try to remember. Okay. At birth, fifty. That you will anyways remember, right? So, this is calculation up to twelve years. You can use this formula. Then, some other uh, height rules. Okay, let's look at this. At two years, half the adult height is attained by two years in girls. Okay. At two years itself, half the adult height. So, what is adult height? The adult height of that girl. So, let us say, what is it at two years? What is it at two years? At two years, we got 90 centimeter. So, adult she will be 180 centimeter. That's too much, isn't it? And for boys, at around two and a half years, whatever height they are, in adult life, they'll be double of that. So, what will they be at around two and a half? Or let us say nine, 90, right? 90 centimeter. Okay. So, if they are 90 centimeter, if they are 90 centimeter at two years, so... By adult, they will become 180. But that is a very huge height. That's a great height, isn't it? That's a great thing, actually. That will be like 5, almost 6 feet. Okay. Let us see this. Um, 5 to 10, sorry, 4 to 10 years, they will add 5 centimeter every year. This we already used, this rule. Then look at this. Onset of puberty, remarkable acceleration and height occurs. So, uh, onset of puberty. Once puberty hits, they will have remarkable on uh, remarkable acceleration and height. There is one more rule guys uh, called as mid parental height. This is yet another formula uh, just trying to estimate may not always be true. Just look at this. Mid parental height is a good predictor of adult height. So, you can predict the height of the child by the parents height. 
So it is calculated using the formula. So what are the formulas? Let us look at these formulas. Mid parental height for boys. <clears throat> Father's height plus mother's height plus 13 by 2. So just pay attention here. It is plus 13 for boy. Uh, everything else is same. Father's height plus mother's height. Take everything in centimeter. Okay. Plus 13 divided by 2. Here they didn't say whether it is centimeter. But let us see. Then this one for girls. For girls it is just minus 13. Okay. Same thing. Father height plus mother's height minus 13 by 2. Take it in centimeter. Okay. You may want to try it. So basically, <clears throat> the adult height. So you are trying to calculate the adult height of the child using the parent's height. Okay. So what is MPH? Mid parental height. Mid parental height. Okay. See, normally we track the weight uh, versus age. Okay. Normally height we are not looking at in the mother protection, mother child protection card. Normally we are not looking at it, but the WHO card has height also. So this, look at this. So this is for uh, birth to three years for girls. Okay. So here you have the height. They have put it as length. So this is the height and this one is the weight. Okay. So look at this. We will just look at the, what you are plotting on the x-axis. Here you have first year of life, second year of life, age. Okay. Third year of life. Okay. Till here. So first year of life, second year of life, third year of life and this is the height. So what will the height be? It actually starts here, the height part or the length part. So let us look at this. What and all we saw now, we will try to plot. Okay. Girl, boy, not much difference. Okay. So let us try to plot this for at birth. At birth, it should be 50 centimeter. <clears throat> right. So here at birth, 50 centimeter at mm, First year birthday 75 centimeter. That is here. At four years. Okay, four years is beyond this. So what else we know? Look at this. We will try to plot again from beginning. At birth 50 centimeter. At birth 50 centimeter. At nine months it is 70. At nine months it is. 70 centimeter at first year it is 75 at the first year it is 75 and at second year birthday it is 90 so 90 second year comes here okay then third year 75 third year is 75 sorry 95 third year is 95 So as you can see, it is the 50th percentile. Are you able to see here? It is the 50th percentile. Can you see here? It's written 50. 50th percentile it is. Right? So 95 centimeter at third year birthday. That is the 50th percentile. So normally we are concerned with the 50th percentile. So that is what we take. That is what is there in the bold also you can see. Right, that is the 50th percentile. Actually, if you see in the Indian um, uh, chart, even in the weight, right, this is the weight part, the 50th percentile is what is considered as normal, right? Below that, it will be undernourished. So, let us come back to height. So, we have uh, started off in this video about what? About height. So, how to calculate child's height? More about the formula. We are not talking about how to cal take the height. No, we are not talking about the measuring. So basically we are uh, talking about formula etc. At birth for a full term baby 50 centimeter. At first year birthday 75 centimeter. It will be uh, a 95 at third year. You can remember this because you have seen in the chart right. Third year 95 centimeter right and fourth year will be 1 meter. Then um, after that you can keep adding 55555. At 10 years you will get 1.30 centimeter. The formula that you can use up till 12 years is here. Okay. What is the formula? Age in years into 6 plus 77. Age in years into 6 plus 77. 77 is some number you can try to remember. 77. 
So, what are the other rules? Half the adult height is attained by around two years for girl and two and a half years for a boy. And um, four to ten years, they put on uh, five centimeter every year. Onset of puberty, there will be remarkable acceleration in height. MPH is mid parental height. It is a good predictor of the adult height that the child will reach. Okay. So, for boys, it is father's height plus mother's height plus 13 divided by 2. For girl child, it is father's height plus mother's height minus 13 divided by 2. Not difficult to remember, hopefully. So, some things you have to remember here. What and all? 77 is there in one formula. 13 is there in one formula. Okay. That's all for now, guys, in this video. Remember, uh, the 50th percentile is considered normal, right? Okay. That's all for now. Bye-bye.